On January 9, 2007, Steve Jobs stepped onto the stage of the Macworld Convention and forever changed the course of media and interconnectivity with his announcement of the iPhone, a groundbreaking product that all at once rendered the competition baseless and reinvented the very market that it innovated so drastically. Simply put, when the first edition of the History of Existence is published, it will come in two volumes, pre-jobs and post-jobs, and it'll be available in the iTunes store as an audiobook for $3.99. Steve Jobs is considered by many to be the last great American, and since his death in 2011 due to a tragic and unexpected turtleneck accident involving an unnamed Microsoft executive only known as Slick Willy, American culture has been utterly rudderless until now. Introducing Oscar Mayer Deli Fresh Honey Smoked Ham, a product so expansive in its imaginative scope, so flawless in its execution, and so delicately balancing on the line between contemporary, retro, and recklessly progressive, one can only assume that nothing will ever be the same again. There is no exaggeration needed and no pretense to be found when I say Oscar Mayer Deli Fresh Honey Smoked Ham is the single most important creation of all time. I know what you're thinking. Oh, here we go. Another hype piece for some lunch meat being touted as the next big thing all across the mainstream home deli sandwich blogosphere. When will the cacophony stop so that I may go quiet into that endless sleep, the unimaginable eternity of silence where wait every waking moment of my miserable existence in this failed experiment called human society isn't filled with the incessant yak, yak, yak about sandwich meat. But what we're experiencing with the launch of Oscar Mayer Deli Fresh Honey Smoked Ham is not just another drop in the bucket of an already overcrowded innovative meats market. It is the complete and total upending of an industry, a renaissance revolution wrapped in a revolutionary renaissance, and it goes great with cheddar or smoked gouda and will permanently alter the course of human history. If I had to compare this deli meat to any 21st century electronic rock album, and I do as per a court order, it would have to be Radiohead's 2001 masterpiece Kid A. Both are virtual paradigm shifts for their creator, grand sweeping epics of experimentation influenced by boundary pushing German innovators, Kraftwerk for Radiohead and Sauerkraut for Oscar Mayer, and both offer an evocative take on alienation and media saturation despite being a generation apart. Still both are surprisingly warm, Kid A because of its use of electric piano, and Honey Smoked Ham because I put it in the toaster for a few minutes. Oscar Mayer has its fanboys, no doubt, those who will consume any Oscar Mayer product simply because Oscar Mayer made it, but more criminal are the knee-jerk detractors who hate everything Oscar Mayer releases indiscriminately. We all have that one friend who constantly says, I don't know, man. I just prefer Android's flexibility and user interface. Even though, as I proved in my 14-page op-ed for the Washington Post last year, the vast majority of Android devices taste awful even with spicy mustard or light mayo. Anyone who says otherwise is full of baloney, and that's not a pun. There are a large number of human baloney hominids posing as regular people among us, released by rival deli companies to negatively influence market trends against Oscar Mayer. Am I saying Oscar Mayer is the victim of some supernatural conspiracy? For legal reasons, technically no. The only thing I'm saying is that with the release of Oscar Mayer Deli Fresh Honey Smoked Ham, despite seeding increasing ground to hip young boutique startup mass producers of animal flesh, Oscar Mayer has firmly reestablished themselves as the absolute top dog of deli meats.